Thank you. It is one thing to read about history. It's another thing entirely to experience history from someone who experienced it themselves. And that's exactly what happened today at Franklin Town Charter High School in Wissanoming. Holocaust survivor and author Michael Fried was just three years old when World War II broke out. His family rounded up by German forces. It's a story that struck a chord with students. There will be times when you feel life is terrible, but I believe it is going to get better. I love talking to young people, opening up their eyes to something that they, you normally don't get exposure to. In 1939, the Germans invaded Poland, and soon after, uh, we were all rounded up and put behind barbed wire. Honestly, it blew my mind, knowing that this generation, we don't get to see a lot of Holocaust survivors. The question that comes next is, how can people be that cruel? Hearing from him just like, it's spoken, like it's words actually hitting me. Not me reading it and taking it one way, it's somebody actually with feelings in a heart. As a teacher, I feel it's very important to have um, someone who has lived and experienced history come and speak to my students. At the Holocaust Awareness Museum, we're dedicated to providing programming to schools. We spend the next three years living in a cellar. Eventually, we were liberated. My mother, God bless her, who is uh, the reason I'm standing here, that I published a book called My Mother's War, and please ask questions or I will feel terrible. To see my students raise their hands and ask these questions, it makes me so proud. I want them to get something more than just about the Holocaust. Just so like we don't make like the same mistakes again in the future. Hatred against anybody is a destructive thing. And my experience taught me never to give up. Don't give up. You get stronger. You're amazed about what you can do. An important story.